Hi there guys, my name's Craig from Nonstop Kids Entertainment and welcome back to another vlog. On today's vlog, I'm going to give you a step-by-step -step guide to booking a children's entertainer for your child's party during lockdown. So, first of all, you've decided that you want a children's entertainer, you've decided that you're not going to let lockdown affect you, you're still going to plan a birthday party, kudos, good for you. So the next step is, which vlog, uh, which vlog, this is the vlog, which children's entertainer should you go for? What, what should you do first? And um, let me make this vlog very quick and say, ignore everyone else, but non stop kids entertainment. There you go, the end, see you next week. <laughs> Obviously, I'm joking. I am biased, however. Uh, uh, you know, I am going to say that Nonstop Kids Entertainment is the best company to book, but that's because I've worked with Nonstop Kids Entertainment. Um, you know, if you're not passionate about your own product, then something's a little bit weird. So, I, I, from a biased point of view, I would say book Nonstop Kids Entertainment. But here's what I'd suggest that you do. I'd suggest that first of all, you do your research. Now obviously, if you're going to have a party in lockdown, the first thing that you need to understand is that you're going to have to have, a, uh, you're going to have to book an entertainer or an entertainment company that specializes in virtual parties. So you're going to want a company that specializes in virtual parties. You don't want to, so, so the first thing is when you go on the website or you go on their social media, you want to make sure that that entertainer does virtual parties. There is a very different skill set that you need to run a virtual party than a normal virtual party. I'm sorry, a normal party. You couldn't just literally go, yeah, I'll do a virtual party and then rock up and do it. A lot of time and effort needs to be put into it. And if you put that time and effort in, you're probably going to advertise online on your websites or on your social media. So first of all, check to see if this is something that is being offered. If it is, brilliant. Step number two is have a look at the reviews for the entertainer, for the entertainment company that you are looking at. Not not just reviews for normal parties, but also reviews for virtual parties. You want to make sure that that company, those entertainers, are doing the best job that they can do. You want to see that there's some good reviews coming in as well, and you can check that normally by checking their Facebook page, by having a look at their reviews, maybe Google, you know, that sort of thing. Now have a look at the reviews for the company that you're looking into. So that's step number two. Step number three, have a look at a showreel. If they are taking this seriously, then they will probably have a showreel in place. It's not just a showreel for their company or for them as an act, but they should have a showreel showcasing their virtual parties. You want to make sure that there is some sort of showreel in place that you can have a look at. Because you want to make sure that the person or the people that you're booking um, mesh with what it is that you're looking for. So you want to make sure that they've got some sort of showreel that you can check out. Also, check out what content that they're putting online because it'll give you a good flavour of what they're like as an entertainer. So for example, with Nonstop Kids Entertainment, we do virtual parties, but we also go live onto our, onto our Facebook page at one o'clock every single day. And we do like magic shows and party games. Uh, we also put YouTube videos up. We put six videos up a day on our YouTube channel of all of our different entertainers doing lots of different things. So it's easy to see whether we are the right company or not to book for because we put so much stuff online you can go check out Facebook live and if you like that then you can have a virtual party you know that you're gonna get a really good uh, quality of show because you've seen the stuff that we do on Facebook live if somebody is offered advertising virtual parties but they're not putting anything online and you can't see an example of their work then that kind of raises question marks so you want to check what stuff you can look at online also, what you want to do um, is you want to, uh, I had another point, I had another point, bear with me. So the first point, second point, third point, fourth point. Yeah, so the other, the other point that you want to consider is the age of the children that are going to be at the virtual party. Have a look at the age range that the control of children that the company is that you're looking for. Have a look at the, the age range of the children that they're catered for. Some entertainers, they just focus on the younger children, which is fine. Some entertainers focus on older children. Some entertainers run the spectrum in terms of the age of the children that we perform for. We specialise in tailoring a package to the age of the kids that are watching. So if they're younger, it'll be tailored for that age. If it's older, they're tailored for that age. Or we can do a package that will work for everybody. But make sure that the person that you're working for, uh, the person that you're looking at, 
conforms to the age of the children that are going to be at the party. Also, have a look at how active their website and their social media feed is. And what I mean by that is if they've got a Facebook page, for example, but they post on it once every two months and there's nothing really going on, that suggests that it's a company that maybe isn't running as smoothly as you think maybe. I mean, if you're, if, you're a, if you're a serious business and you have a Facebook page, why would you not be posting on that all the time? Especially if you're locked in your house with nothing else to do. Um, you know, if you look at, again, I have to use us as an example because I know what we do. But if you look at Nonstop Kids Entertainment, you know, we're posting on all of our social media uh, uh, you know, channels all of the time. We're always on YouTube, we're always on Twitter, we're always on Instagram, we're always on Facebook. You can see see us constantly uploading things so you can see that we're really busy and you can see that we're you know tr constantly trying to communicate with our customer and that communication is key so that's something else that you need to consider as well so when you're planning your virtual party the most important thing is to make sure that the person that you're considering booking is going to be there and they're going to do a great job right so uh, you want to make sure that they will handle all the technical side of things for you because if you're running a virtual party and let's say you're having an hour package, well, you wouldn't want to do that yourself. You wouldn't want to set up that yourself. Um, you'd want to have it set up for you by the company that you're booking. Um, you, you know, a lot of people use Zoom. We use Zoom when we plan our virtual parties. And if you have a free Zoom account after 40 minutes, you get kicked out. So you have to have a professional paid Zoom account, which is something you might not have. So you want to make sure that the person that you're booking has a professional paid Zoom account. The other thing is with a professional paid Zoom account, you can have a video sent to you afterwards of the, of the, the whole performance. You can't do that with a free account. So the person that you're booking, make sure that they've got everything they need to successfully believe from a technical point of view make sure that that party is going to run flawlessly you know from our point of view when we run a virtual party we have somebody from head office watching the feed the whole time to make sure that everything is going smoothly and they can step in if there's an issue we have a zoom account we run everything we send the link out to you we can structure it for as long as you want us to we make sure that when we're filming it we've got two devices that we're filming from including something that's not reliant on wi-fi so if the wi-fi goes down it switches to the secondary device. All this stuff is really important because what you don't want to have happen is you don't want to have your virtual party to time out halfway through because your entertainer has lost their internet. So you need to consider all of this different stuff. This is also really important stuff that you need to consider and you need to make sure that the entertainer that you're considering booking has all this in place. Finally, make sure that you can get them on the phone because you want to speak to them about this stuff. You want to make sure that there's communication there. Make sure you can speak to them on the phone or if you're emailing them or messaging them on social media, make sure they're getting back to you quickly because you want to make sure that that communication is there just in case there's any issues. So there you go. Guys, whoever you decide, I want to give you a big thumbs up for deciding to have a virtual party. I think it's a really good idea to make sure that our children still have parties during this lockdown. Um, and I, I commend you, I clap you, give you a virtual pass for that. Uh, if you want to speak to us at Nonstop Kids Entertainment, we'd love to chat to you. There's a couple of ways you can get in touch with us. First of all, send us a message on Facebook. Second of all, send us an email. Third of all, fill in the contact form on our website, nonstopkids.co.uk, and we'll get back to you. Or finally, give us a call, 0333 301 3002. One of our staff will answer the phone and tell you all about our different parties. So that's it. Don't forget to subscribe on YouTube. Uh, on YouTube, We put videos up there all the time. Don't forget to follow us on Facebook. And I will see you again with another vlog very, very soon. Thank you very much for watching. My name's Craig from Nonstop Kids Entertainment.